Hi students, welcome to Ajitaha IAS Academy and also welcome to our economics budget class. In this video, we will discuss about the economics current affairs and also a recent article about how to catch the missed rivers. We will discuss in detail about what is this missed rivers and how can we catch it. Recently, the questions in the prelims examination is transforming from a factual base to a more analytical base. So this article is going to help you in more analytical interpretation, both from the perspective of the CSAT and also from the perspective of the uh, general studies. So let us start our class. The missed opportunity, that is the missed burst, was nothing but a manufacturing opportunity. India has missed the opportunity of 1980s in the manufacturing sector, which other uh, Asian giants, for example, China, Vietnam, have, and Singapore, South Korea, and Japan have utilized. To go into details, India and China in 1983 had similar per capita GDP. Why we are comparing with China instead of Vietnam, Singapore is the population. In order to calculate the per capita, we need the total GDP and the population. So while population of India and China was almost similar and the, these are the two most populous countries in the world, we take China as an example in order to compare our economic model. And these are also the countries which got uh, independence at the same time. That is why. So in 1983s, India and China had similar per capita GDP. However, by 2022, the per capita GDP of China is five times of India. How China has achieved this? China has achieved this through the development in the manufacturing and the export sector. That is, manufacturing means building of shipping, iron and steel, and other sectors, and export-led growth is the plants of assembly, that is, for example, uh, the production of the computer parts. For example, the design of a computer, if it is made in the European countries, for example, USA and Europe, the assembly is being made in the China. And the components to make these assembled parts is also being manufactured in India, sorry, in China. So the assembly and the manufacturing and the exports of these two sectors has helped China to realize high per capita GDP that is achieving higher GDP. So it transitioned from the lower to the higher per capita GDP. So India should also focus on the manufacturing and export sector. And however, India in the recent COVID times has grabbed this opportunity what we have missed in the 1980s through a judicious mix of protection and incentives. When we say about protection, a levy of the import duty and banning of the finished goods has helped us to achieve this. That is, recently I have made a video about uh, India imposing the uh, countervailing duty on the import of certain Chinese toys and other items. And also through incentive schemes, I am talking about the PLI scheme, production linked incentive scheme and 100% FDI in certain sectors of exports. With these two measures, India has surpassed the USA and South Korea to become the second largest manufacturer globally. With this, India has achieved, that is, a showcase, a development in the lo local manufacturing, that is, regrowth and development of the Indian economy, what we have seen and observed in the last two quarters. And our GST collections has also surpassed more than rupees 1.2 trillion dollars for the first time ever in the last four and five years. And this had also created the jobs in the Indian market and it also helped India to achieve the trade surplus which India was struggling to achieve for many decades. So in order to grab this opportunity in a more better way, imagine replicating the success model across multiple sectors like specialty steel, toys and bulk drugs, and automobiles, auto components, technical textiles, food products, solar PV modules, medical devices, etc. Because if you see during the pandemic, China was take, 
trying to take the opportunity of manufacturing the PPE kits and also taking control of the African and the European countries into its debt trap. So India can grab this more opportunity and replicate the success model of manufacturing and export. And we can also uh, increase our per capita GDP and other benefits of economy. This is also a opportunity time for India to expand the manufacturing sector and improve our external market share because the present geopolitical imperative is China plus one plus one means alternative to China that is China plus one the world is trying to look for an alternative of China in both the logistics and the manufacturing and the export sector so India can utilize this geopolitical situation of geopolitical imperative of china plus one in order to expand our market share and our consumer market also india's strength which other countries of europe asia and china was lacking is domestic market so to realize the two potential of our manufacturing and export sector and uh, uh, domestic market a close coordination between and the seamless working between the central government, state government, and the local government, and the proper implementation of the rule of law, and implements in the infrastructure, that is roadways, and the uh, railways, that is freight, and logistics sector, and the electricity connection, and ease of doing business, and more than important, uh, that is flexible labor laws is important. Though we have brought the changes in the labor codes, the implementation has been put on hold for different reasons. So these are the suggestions being given by the author in order to bring in as a policy in the coming budget. And also India need to properly adequately prepare in order to counter the Chinese attacks both from the cyber, that is cyber attacks and also from the border issues. Because as India is a huge alternative to China in the global geopolitics, China will try to attack the India through multiple ways. So India must be adequately prepared. So these are the details that about this article. If you have any doubts, please comment and we will clarify those issues and we will make more videos about the PLI and other schemes we have mentioned about in this video. Thank you so much.